Hey guys, let's see what is in 2023 NDP Fun Pack. That is what we call it growing up. I'm not sure if we still call it in this day and time the Fun Pack or is it just like a goodie bag. So this year, it comes in a canvas bag. It's so good quality and you know what's the best part? It comes with Velcro in it, which is so great. I have so many canvas bags but none of them have a Velcro closure on top. I remember growing up, Okay, I must say, mm, the last NDP fun pack that I got was when I was still very young, still in secondary school, participating in NDP. And back then, it was just like those bags that were windbreaker material, you know, those thin ones that make the most ridiculous sound, and you could actually tear it. So this is definitely like an upgrade. I think the times have changed. It is so different. It has this print inside here on Word as one with the NDP year over here. And it also has like, oh wow! This thing itself, the little pocket also has a velcro. It's so well made compared to the olden days. It has a very pretty design uh, which reminds me of, I don't know, maybe because it's a round shape so it's very non ya kind of design. It has all these like schools here which I do not know why but it's pretty. So let's look at what is inside. I did look at this last night. The first thing that I pulled out last night was this and I was so stunned by this. It's so thin, but it is a fan and it is so windy, like so well made for it being like a very thin thing that you can actually, somehow you crush it like so, you can put it inside this pouch and then it's just like a tiny little thing that you put in your purse, but it is like so windy for it being so thin. So I'm, this is like the most well made thing I've ever seen. It just feels like a piece of fabric and then there's just like maybe wiring on the side but it is phenomenal and growing up we just had those um, thick cardboard as a fan. So that is the first item. Uh, definitely I will be keeping that. <laughs> maybe bring it to Bangkok. It would be great in that weather. Obviously we have the Singapore flag which is kind of useless because today is national day already. So how, how am I going to use this? I only have one like a few hours to use this. So it is with the brand. Oh, I love looking at the brand sponsors. This one is locally grown, fresh produce. Oh, SFA is with a SFA collaboration. So not bad. Now the Singapore flag is with this brand called Citrum, which I have no idea what it is. Maybe the marine company somewhere in Singapore. Really not sure, but anyway, yay. We have a flag that came way too late, so it's useless now. My mom did get a Singapore flag a few weeks back, so she had it hanging from her door, which I thought was quite funny. Next up, we have this one here that is so pretty. The packaging is so nice. It even says over here, NDP 2023 sponsor. It is from the brand Pola, and it's the Nature Drops Herbal Candy Himalayan Pink Salt, a very trendy flavor. It is super pretty, but not like a ton inside. And it is so thoughtful, right? Like, because you're going to be screaming, you're going to be scream singing the song. So you're going to need herbal candy drops at the end of the day when you lose your voice. I think it is so funny. We would have never gotten this in the olden days. This is like the most thoughtful gift ever. We do have a pack of instant noodles here, which I have no idea why, but it is extremely practical. <laughs> this one is a brand that I've never heard of, Asian Taste. Instant noodles, 3-in-1 chicken flavor. So it looks like there's probably a flavor packet inside here. This one will definitely be eaten by my husband. He is quite excited for this. I thought it was quite ridiculous, but okay. And obviously we have the useless things that is like the most noisy, irritating thing ever. It does say, oh, this is with Songhe, which is the rice brand. And it's just like a drum. So you do that. Very irritating. Back when we were young, we would have this irritating clapper. Oh, we didn't have drum, I think. We had those two... Uh, air filled clapper that you just keep clapping together. It is the same irritating degree of sound. <laughs> and then it came with this thing which I'm assuming is a drum thing for you to make the noise if you don't want to use your hand. And it is also with citrum. It looks like there's something here so I'm thinking it is a light stick. Alright, let's take it out because there is a tap here. Maybe when you pull it out. No, there's... Oh, oh, oh! There is... A light, so at night you can do this while you're singing along to the song. How do I stop this? Oh, not bad, you just tap it and it stops. Seriously, technology is so scary now. They can, like, two in one a light stick and a drum stick. When we were young, there was no such thing. You just use your hands. And then we have obviously a water bottle, 
and we were young, we only had useless things. We didn't have like the gum, the gum drops. We would have the irritating clappers and a bottle of water, and that was it inside the bag. This one I've never seen before, but it's actually a Yo's brand water, which I am not sure if Yo's is Singapore or Malaysia. Oh, product of Malaysia. Okay, fine. So it's not a Singapore brand, but it is a brand of drinks that everybody grew up with. That's very useful. Next up, we just have, you know, the tattoos from a brand collaboration that I've never heard of. Well, this will be popular with the kids, but we have no use for it. Oh, I forgot to tell you, my husband came back with this bag last night. And I was like, why are you bringing rubbish bag? <laughs> because I just assumed that it would just all be clappers and nothing else inside. But it is turning out to be very useful and just such a great experience because we've never seen an NDP bag for so long. We actually have the NDP tickets uh, we had for the actual day itself and also a few weeks before that. When we got a ticket, the first thing we did was, let's just give it away. So we gave away all the tickets. My sister's family is going for the NDP itself today. But I didn't expect him to get so many free NDP bags. So he gave away all of the bags. I think he had 10 and then he just brought one bag for me to <laughs> experience. We do have this over here. There's like so much food. That's why I thought it was all rubbish. But he told me to look inside because there is a lot of food. This one here is... Captain 1965, not sure, never heard of this brand, but it's just granola honey almond which he will eat. He's quite excited about this. I think it's so useful because you can sit there and just keep munching. We do have this over here which is our local brand, Kong Guan, and it's just the biscuits and I'm very surprised that none of it... Okay, you can kind of hear the crumbs but it kind of feels like still intact. So they're not crushed yet which is super surprising to me. I thought it would be crushed by now. And it feels like quite a hefty pack, but it isn't a nice one because you can see it is the butter cookies. Like people buy that big Kong Guan tin and we all aim for the chocolate one. So this is the not nice flavor because they don't have the chocolate. We do have another useless thing over here, which is a card. It is the Chris Flyer card. And I thought it was like, why? What's the point until I saw this, which is the Chris Flyer thing too. Uh, this is absolutely useless. <laughs> in my opinion but my husband loves this kind of things he's gonna keep it he was like so excited to look at the badges because they are like limited edition design so it does say Chris Flyer so cute with a little author or walrus I'm not sure but it's super adorable and then on this side it does say like a discount e-coupon I don't know what's that it has this one which is a Malayan with the word I love SG it's just like a pin I think yeah to like pin on your bags and stuff Maybe they, if they, it was like magnet, maybe that would be way more practical. But yeah, he loves this, so I think he's gonna be keeping this. Let me show you. I, I think I've been saving the best for the last. I was so excited when I pulled this out. Excuse me. This is like the most practical thing ever. We would never have such a thing when we were growing up. This one is from the brand EcoSum, which honestly never heard of. But it's so festive, the packaging. It also sells like a refill. It is a pocket bag. He has, my husband has never seen this before. I was telling him the term is called pocket bag. It's like amazing because you can fit it in your purse. You slide it. Oh, and then you spray. So good. I freaking love this. I'm so excited for this. This is such a thoughtful NDP goodie bag. And there's more. There is a... Uh, the next thing that I pulled out was this one. Oh my goodness. It's so practical because it is mosquito repellent liquid spray so easy to use and it doesn't have the oh, okay it's brand new silk so i cannot put it up it seems like it doesn't have the uh, very strong citronella scent which is going to be so good because it does have the word floral on it so hopefully it's good for kids i remember when we went to penang and i brought the citronella roll on and it was like a very strong scent but it really did work so this is like such a small travel size it's going to be so useful for traveling it is Sofel, which I have no idea, I never heard of, but I freaking love this and I've never seen a floral scented citronella spray. Oh, okay, there's actually no citronella inside here, but hopefully it still works in terms of mosquito repelling. And then we have this one, so useful because of the pandemic, I guess. So they are coming out with all these very useful things that can be used for years to come. This one is V-Stop. Alcohol-free disinfectant spray. A lot of a lot of words in very tiny font. <laughs> Singapura Tembusu. I have no idea what that means. Oh, it's so cute. All right, so we're here. Happy 58th birthday. So it's just like such a good size and so useful because 
you are stuck there sweating, watching that NDP parade, and then your kid will want to have a snack, right? So you spray your hand and you can eat it. Eat your Kongguan biscuit, I guess. Well, I'm so excited for those three sprays. And then we do have this over here, which is from Zappy. Uh, it is just like the normal packaging. It doesn't look like it's a product sponsor, but I mean, I would assume they will put like a red color one. Maybe Zappy is too big and they don't even want to bother sponsoring, who knows? And it's just so useful because it is food contact wipes. Oh, alcohol free, but it's like antibacterial wipes. I love these kind of things. Alright, so that's all for the bag. There's so much things here and a lot of them are actually useful. Honestly, I'm very happy to experience the NDP fun pack because that's probably like the best part of going to the NDP parade because you get a souvenir, I guess. Even if people paid us, we would never ever go for the NDP parade because of the humidity, I guess, or we just cannot be bothered enough to go for it. But I do think that there are two songs like the home song by Kit Chan, I think, and also another song which is like One People, One Nation, One Singapore. I think that are, that's the lyrics. Or is it This Is My Country, This Is My Home? Wow, those two. Whenever I hear those two songs, I feel like crying. <laughs> so I guess that's the extent of my love for this country. Oh, especially when you land in Changi Airport and then they say welcome home. You just feel like, yes, this is my country. Okay, so yeah, I'm going back to not caring, but I'm very happy with this goodie bag. Hopefully you had some fun looking at what's inside too.